What's up, everyone? Welcome to the Power Play with CJ. Uh, this one kind of came out of left field. The uh, Buffalo Sabres traded a third-round pick for the rights to negotiate with Jimmy Vesey. Something I uh, really did not see coming. I mean, I you know I thought the Bruins, Rangers, Leafs, Devils, and Penguins would be the five teams for Vesey. And obviously, Buffalo kind of came in from the clouds. and was like, yeah, we're going to take them. You know, and nothing's guaranteed in this trade. There's no guarantees on the contract with the Sabres. So they're really going out on a limb here, and uh, you know we'll see what it means for the uh, the the Buffalo Sabers. And you know if he doesn't sign there, it's not a conditional pick. It's not like oh if we sign him you get a third. It's a third round pick straight up. So come August fifteenth, if he signs anywhere but Buffalo, then uh, that's that's not good. But according to Bob McKenzie, uh, the Sabers have talked to his agent, um, and the uh, is it Agent Peter Fish is also Jack Eichel's agent. Now Jack Eichel and Jimmy Vesey are both playing in a pro am league in Boston this summer. Both Massachusetts guys, you know, hey, maybe you know, come over here and play, Jimmy. Uh, you know, both being pot schools. I mean, there, there's plenty there to to like, and you know, quite frankly, um, you know, as a college hockey fan and a Massachusetts native, I'd really like to see the two of them play together. But you know, we'll see what happens. Um, I there's no guarantees here, but I, if I was a betting man, I'd say it's a better than 50% chance he signs with the Sabres because they wouldn't have made this deal had that not been the uh, had they not felt like they had a really strong chance to uh, to ink them to an entry level deal. But then again, Nashville didn't make a move at the deadline because they had they thought they had him signed. So one of those situations to kind of just watch and see how it materializes in the next uh, next few weeks and you know if it doesn't work out with, with Buffalo then he will be a free agent on August 15th meaning teams will be lining up for him around the league but for the for the record Buffalo had to have known something was up when this uh, this deal went down uh, the pick is the 76th overall and VZ went 66 overall, so yeah, kind of a kind of a wash. Except the fact that VZ will, VZ, I'm not gonna say a guarantee, but he's closer to a guarantee than you know whoever the 18 year old Buffalo, uh, yeah, the the Predators draft. But God bless Dave Foyle for trying to get something back out for him. That's just the way it works. So you know, he, I don't think he's gonna walk away completely bamboozled. But anyway. That's all I got in this episode of the Power Play with CJ. Stay tuned for episodes throughout the off season and beyond. Later, guys.